There are a number of vital issues that affect the survival and sustainability of the human race on the globe today. Of those, none is more important than climate change and dealing with carbon, carbon emissions, and the effect it's having on the atmosphere, on ocean rise, on the climate, on agriculture. If we do not control climate change, it will destroy the human race in, and civilization as we know it. So that is an absolutely vital issue. And the paralysis of nation states in dealing with this problem creates a gigantic problem. That's one of the issues we should be dealing with at the G8. A second issue that defines this decade is the issue of religion, religious fanaticism, religious extremism, and on the other side, religious ecumenical feeling, religious universality. Religion has become both the venue for the most important conflicts, hatreds, and wars of the world, and it also holds out the promise of bringing humankind together as children of a one God. Uh, both those are there. Again, the role of religion in our politics, in our economics, in our cultural societies is a second major role. The reality is we live in a world of nation states that aren't dealing effectively with either of these problems. And that brings me to the third subject, which in a way responds to the issue of how do we deal with climate change? How do we deal with religious conflict? And my answer is stop talking about states and stop, start talking about cities. And that means that cities, the focus on cities, cities governing themselves democratically, cities working together globally, becomes a third absolutely vital topic because it's a question of changing the paradigm of modern governance in a way that allows democracy once again to deal with issues it's not dealing with very well, namely the first two, climate change and religious strife, religious conflict, and religious division. There are a number of other things that city government, government of a parliament of mayors would also deal with, but those are among the most important issues that mayors have to deal with, and you do will, and that states are not dealing with. So there you have it, three th issues, climate change, religion and religious division, and changing the subject from nation states to cities as a basis for government in responding to global problems we face. Those, to me, are three of the most significant problems we face and would be a welcome focus uh, for our G8 meetings.